My name is Jodie Bunting, oh, this Bunting. is Natasha Gant and welcome to the end of week number one, the start of week number two of Natasha's body transformation. Natasha, how's it been? It's been really hard, really up and down, um, loads of changes in my body, um, it's been really difficult, very difficult. Day one was okay. It's day one of <laughs> Natasha Gant's transformation and we join her here at her desk. Um, Natasha, how are you feeling right now? I'm craving sugar and I don't know why. <laughs> I'm fine. I feel a bit tired because I didn't go to bed um, till midnight because um, we went out for our last blast before the transformation began. So, um, no, I feel okay. So you're craving sugar? Yeah, I'm craving sugar. And how are you feeling? I feel tired because I didn't go to bed early enough, but um, apart from that I feel good. I've eaten well, I've eaten twice already and it's 10 to 2. I'm training tonight at 6 and I want tea. <laughs> We've got a meeting at 2 with a lady from um, a charity we're doing some work for. And it's just so the normal thing is, will be to have tea. So yeah, I want tea and I'm craving sugar, but apart from that all's good. And I've drunk. I'm drinking water anyway, this is my second bottle, so I think I was dehydrated from last night. So I've drunk two litres of water already at two o'clock. Okay, your exercise programme was set last night as well. How are you feeling yeah, about excited. that? Yeah, excited. It looks really good. So I'm going to be doing um, cardio on Monday, Wednesday and Friday, um, and then the weights and core stuff on Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday with Sunday off. So watch this space. Excellent. Day two, I felt like um, I had the flu, so all of my body ached, um, I didn't have any energy. I still trained in the evening, which I shouldn't have done, so because I felt like that, I literally stopped training for the rest of the week. Okay, now Natasha's just finished her first exercise session. No, second. Okay, second exercise session. The girls were over here um, joining in Natasha's circuit. How, how did you feel, Natasha? How did I feel? You're looking quite sweaty and worked no, out. Really Is it good? Yeah. All right, it's about happy. I'll get a first aid for you. Fine. Okay, so adding extra weight all the time. It's very good. Do you think you've eaten yeah. adequately to fuel your Absolutely. body for this? No, I feel good. I still feel a little bit unwell, I don't know whether I've said that, but no, I feel like my glands are a bit up and I felt like I was sweating an ill sweat as opposed to a workout sweat, so we'll see. It's and probably all part of the details. And how much water have you drank today? I've drunk three litres and this is the I've already had three litres, so by the end of the day it'll be three and a half. And is that a usual amount? Three litres, I think, a day, yeah. Okay, now just quickly moving over to Craig Maddox, the fitness expert. <laughs> I'm trying to catch what, up my <laughs> Okay, what do, how do you think Natasha's been getting on? What do you think to her physical Amazing. state at the well, moment? She's going to have to be good if she's going to be me. I've been spot on, right, 100%. Hang on. I lifted more weights than all of those in there, and they trained all the time, so. Yeah. Heavy weights. Craig? Oh, I hope, you know, I need some competition, so. I spent the day with Natasha and um, yeah. she's been eating really well, so bring it on. Well done, Natasha. Day three, I came home from work early, so I felt like I had the flu again. And then on day three, I had massive like erupt skin eruptions on my chin, which is still here, but they're getting much better. Okay, now we're joining Natasha here with her water, and this is a this water is a only saving grace at the moment. Natasha, how are you feeling? <laughs> Pretty rough, to be honest. Why? Um, Tuesday morning, I started feeling like really lethargic and had flu like symptoms. Um, and by the end of the day, they got worse. And yesterday, I felt like I had full blown flu. So, and this is all detoxing. So, um, good luck, everyone. <laughs> Today, I feel a little bit better than yesterday, but I've still got like swollen glands. Like my face was puffy. I've got massive outbreaks. Oh, don't zoom in on them. I've got massive outbreaks on my chin, but I'm going to go and have a facial in one minute to hopefully try and get rid of them or help them. Um, but really difficult. Yesterday and today, I'm craving sugar quite badly. Um, and I didn't really have sugar beforehand, but I'm really craving sugar right now. Um, so it's quite rough, but mentally I feel amazing. So um, And I know I'm doing it all for the right reasons, but my body's just really tired and really heavy 
Um, but I'm mentally I'm fine. Um, but I've just got to keep going. But detox normally um, lasts three to four days. This is day four, so hopefully tomorrow I'll be fine. Um, but I'm not exercising now for the rest of the week because I feel so rough. Um, and obviously that would be a stress and make me feel a little bit worse. So Back to work, Natasha. Back to work, yes. I've really felt bad, um, but today I feel loads better, loads more energy. So we're on day six today so um, any of you that are following it day two three and four are pretty rough but once you get through it and all the toxins have come out of your body um, then you feel much better so um, yeah so it's been a strange week lots of cravings as well I've got to tell you about that um, sugar cravings um, I had really bad and really wanted to drink tea more out of habit than anything else and um, so I always had a couple of cups of tea a day um, so it's been really difficult but I feel great today so it's all been worth it so far my name is Jenny Bunting and welcome to day number two here with Lady Natasha Gant as we go into Sainsbury's okay now Natasha's here looking at the looking spices at the, no, and the, the organic sea salt oh nice you're going to put a pinch of salt in your water or don't do that so I was thinking about that now here we are with Natasha's organic shop here back at <laughs> the flat. Um, there's some beautiful button organic mushrooms. Um, I can see some burgers hanging out this bag over here. <laughs> now let me just show you this chocolate quilt as well because it's really quite divine. The, the three different shop colours in Sainsbury's there. Because I'm spending for my things. I normally go to like John Lewis or something, but because I'm spending so much on organic food, I've got to be a little bit careful. <laughs> okay, and just delving into these bags, you can also see some um, steaks, um, some honey roast salmon fillet some king prawns um natasha is very very happy to discover these corn cakes are 100 percent corn so i'm allowed to eat these yeah, so why why does this make you so happy because it gives like some slight variety for lunches you can have like a snack with them some meat on or pate or something so i'm quite excited about those Lots of organic nuts I've bought. These are like two quid a bag, which is a joke, but it's all going to be worth it in the end. <laughs> and then over that side, a few more carbs, some carrot batons. Raw carrots, organic bananas. What's been the low light of the week? The low light, my chin, because not only if you feel really bad, um, like you want to, like you're craving sugar, then at least if you know it's good and you're looking good, then that's great. So that was quite bad. And feeling rough. Just literally, I could have been in a ring with like Mike Tyson. I thought I'd been beaten up. It's like dragging my body around. But mentally, I've been really good all week. So um, it's just my body was sort of like dragging behind me. But, but yeah, so that was pretty low. But it's only for a couple of days. And if you know that, you know, it's all for a good reason. And I feel great today, really good. So. And what's been your highlight of the week? <laughs> Should there have been one, sorry. <laughs> um, I really enjoyed the training on Tuesday. Um, so I'm looking forward next week to getting into my training more because now I feel better. Um, I've lost um, five pounds so far. So I've got the scales this morning. So Isn't that amazing? Well, I would expect it's good, but um, I'm doing it for my health, not for the loss of weight. So um, it is amazing, but I cutting out everything I've cut out, that would, you know, that would happen, so... Yeah, it's good, really good. If you do have a hiccup, then forget about that day and move on to the next day and start again. But um, if you're detoxing, you can't have a hiccup. So the first month, you've got to be 100%. Okay, looking forward to week number two. What are you looking forward yeah, to this exercise. week? I'm looking forward to feeling better. I feel like really energised today. So uh, that's not good for people that I work with because I'm quite hyperactive anyway. So. No, I feel really good. I feel really good. Sometimes with my eyes look really clear this morning, so um, I'm feel looking. Then I'm looking forward to feeling good and training. So. And finally, Craig, Craig versus Natasha. Who's winning? Oh my God! There's no competition. I'm winning. There's no competition at all. He, I know he's not faulted either. So you wait till you, till you hear what he's got to say. But um, I, so I will win. There's no competition. Is it? Thank you, Natasha. We look forward to catching you next week.